Contractor fired for having KKK and Confederate flag decals on his lunchbox. That photo posted to social media led to a Department of Public Works investigation Friday. It's the second incident involving contractors from a Waukesha County company. In the other, a group of workers was photographed brandishing guns on a city job. Within the hour, multiple organizations will hold a city hall rally to protest those incidents. Our Kareen Zell joins us live from that location. Kareen. George and Carol, this is the area where the city contractor was spotted with a KKK sticker and a Confederate flag on their lunchbox. Over the weekend, this showed up on the contractor's equipment. It says, racists, go home. The city hired American Sewer Services out of Hartford for this job. The Department of Public Works says the employee with the cooler in question has been fired. This is the same company with employees caught on camera holding guns on a job site at 19th and Meineke. The contractor is also believed to employ the person who sent racial messages to council members. American Sewer Services says they're working on updating their policies to stop anything like this from happening again. City leaders are drafting a resolution to ban guns from subcontractors on the job. This is not just it's not going to be tolerated within the city limits of, of the city of Milwaukee, especially when taxpayer dollars are being used to pay for this work. The alderman says the company was asked not to work today. That company will appear before council on Thursday. And coming up tonight at 6, there is a rally expected where city leaders will speak out about this racism. We'll have more for you on that tonight at 6 and 10. Reporting live, Corrine Zell, today's TMJ4. Corrine,